New Year's Eve basketball in Beaconville Women's Basketball taking on Eastern Nazarene College to close out the 2022 calendar year. And it would be a good one at the start. Early on, the Beacon trailing 7-0. Tatiana Feffrey, who had a career game with 10 points and 6 boards, lays it up at home there as the Beacons cut into that 7-0 deficit down to 7-2. And then to end off the first quarter, Sabela Jensen with a layup after the steal. And then Feffrey with a layup of her own. Beacons head into the second quarter, tied up at 11 all. And the second quarter would be a big one for the Beacons. How many points can Alexa Potter score for this Beacon squad in the second? There you see she's already got four. And then another layup there makes it six. The Beacons in control by 12 now. Potter getting the pass right there. Makes it eight, and now she's going to have 10 on this pass from February. Later on, it's going to be 12 in the post down low. The mismatch gets it to fall. The Beacons just pulling away in this one. 14 points right here on another layup. And then Potter's actually going to close out the second quarter on this rebound and layup. 16 points for Alexa Potter in the second quarter alone. The Beacons head into halftime, leading by 22 after a 28-6 to second quarter. And then... In the third, Meg Dixon scores eight points for the Beacons. Dixon had a big day, 23 points and 13 rebounds for her fourth double-double of the season in 31 minutes. You see this one right here on the jumper with just under two minutes to go in the third. And then at the buzzer, Sunny Green with the jumper. Beacons still in control heading into the fourth quarter of this one. And then down the stretch, Paige Olivier with a pair of three-pointers helps extend the Beacon lead up to 30 points. Olivier from the left side right there makes that six points on the afternoon. And then Emily Garufi off the bench with a two-pointer closing out the Beacons day with a 70-38 to victory at home. The Beacons getting back on track after falling the 6-6 six and six on the year. They are now 7-6 and six heading into the 2023 calendar year. They kick off their Little East Conference slate of games in the new year on January 4th, a Wednesday night on the road against Castleton University at 5 o'clock p.m.